I'm, I just love cooking. I guess you could say I like the challenge, especially like pastries, because it's kind of like science. You don't nail it just right, you're gonna have to do it again. Louis, you knock over my coolie, we're gonna have a problem. Hi, I'm Sergeant First Class Boggs, and I'm on the Fort Durham Culinary Arts team. Fort Drum is competing in the Joint Culinary Training Exercise this March at Fort Lee. The annual event gives military chefs an opportunity to showcase their talents up against American Culinary Foundation standards. I definitely think Fort Drum's Culinary Arts team um, is very committed to what we do. Last year they came in second, but Specialist Wee Wen was able to take home Student Chef of the Year. That's what we got to do. So last year I was a student. Uh, my first year on the team, I went down to Fort Lee and I ended up winning. So that was a great accomplishment. I still have a lot of room to improve. Uh, I still have a lot to learn, but I want to keep going as far as I can. And to me, it's fun playing with different ingredients and taking something and turning it into a whole new thing. Preparing the Fort Drum Culinary Arts team for competition has made an impact on Sergeant Boggs. It is a very challenging job. It's basically taking 10 unique personalities, skill sets, and trying to push them all in the same direction, four different directions at one time to accomplish one mission, and that's to uh, win the competition. Competitors are able to hone their abilities as culinary arts specialists, which improves the quality of food services to their units, preparing them to better perform in garrison and in a deployed environment. Today was our last and our very first run through of a three course. So the fact that we were able to literally overnight knees for a three course and put one out, um, not doing it before with this menu, I believe that we are right where we need to be. This year's Ford Drum student chef has been in the Army a little over a year, but she's ready to compete. Of course I'm going to win. <laughs> of course. I want to leave my recipe out, let's get all my ingredients together, leave my equipment and get ready for my run through, which is, I practice my dish, my student chef dish. And I actually cook it for Sergeant Box and they judge it, tell me how it is, what mistakes I can make better, what I can do better. Competing for a place on the culinary team has helped PFC Lewis develop her craft. Um, I learned so many new things, like from each and every person, like, no matter if they're like a private or they're my rank or they're E7, like I learned so many new things that I can take back to my deep back and I can take back in my career for myself. Like Sergeant Boggs emphasizes that the competition challenges military chefs to improve their skills in the deep back, which in turn improves soldiers' nutrition and readiness of the force. You're always going to have those few individuals that want to make Army food service better and also just continue to build on the culinary side. I feel that we have a lot to bring to the table.